I got the heat on full blast and Great. it's a little it's a little uh, a little it's bit too cold for me even outside. So. It feels good though. Oh yeah. Yeah, how's Cindy doing? She's she's doing well. She did she hasn't had her surgery yet, right? Uh, actually, she did. Oh, she and did. So it's just a, a day trip to Missoula. Oh yeah. So. And when was that? Was uh, last week? About yes. Yeah. How's she doing with that? She's doing well. So. Good. Her, her kitty is uh, pretty much fully recovered. Oh. So. Mm. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Her little boy, right? Yep. She's oh, about, yeah. uh, or he's about, uh, almost, uh, uh he's, he's pretty close in age to uh, Isaiah. Isaiah's oh, about three years old. Oh, yeah. So it's kind of hard to believe that I've had him that long, but yes, indeed, I have. Uh, Tr Tracy reminded me of that oh, today. Yeah. That, uh, it's been about three years since, uh, he uh, gave him to me. Yeah. And they still have his his uh, brother and his mom. Oh yeah. So, you saw Tracy today? Uh, no, I talked to him for a bit. I'll be seeing him this week. Oh uh, yeah. At the, at the shop. So. Oh good. You're working at the shop gonna now. Do, yep. Going to be doing that. Uh, Sounds good. As I can, and uh, and uh, hopefully. Uh, Hopefully we'll uh, go out on some tow runs with him and Hope so. So that is uh, dependent on, uh, on some work he's got to do on the tow, uh, tow truck tomorrow. He's got to uh, clean the uh, clean the uh, gas lines out of it and see if uh, see if he can actually get it to start. Wendell Ford was not able to find anything wrong with it. Huh. So, uh, so you spend about twelve hundred dollars for them to find out that uh, they couldn't find anything wrong with it. Oh my! So, <laughs> oh, yep. So he and but it won't start. So yeah, and, and that indi indicates a fuel pressure problem. Oh my. Well, they couldn't find anything wrong. They, well, they should have been able to. That, yeah, that, for that, $1,200. That's, that's easy to find. Yeah. You, hook, you hook up a, a, a fuel pressure gauge, which I have, by the way. I have one of those. Uh -huh. And uh, just uh, turn the key and uh, see if it uh, gives you any pressure. And so... I forget if there's a blockage. Or, the, or it could be a bad fuel pump. Huh. But yes, a blockage, a blockage can cause that as well. But the blockage will also burn out a fuel pump if it's, if it's not trying right. to quickly enough. So, yeah. Luckily in this, if the fuel pump ever needs to be replaced, it's right here under the back seat. So we don't, we wouldn't have to drop the tank. In this? Yes. It's very, very easy to get to. Where is it in your tow truck? Uh, about the same, it would be the same difficulty as it would be for Dixie to, to change it because uh, the tow truck and the Dixie are on the same frame. Where, They're both, I mean, uh, where is it in, the, in, in Dixie? On Dixie, it's actually right underneath, uh, it's, uh, the fuel pump access for her is actually right to, uh, right to, uh, It's it's basically right under the uh, the bathroom floor. Oh. So uh, so I would have to drop the tank to, to get to it. Right. Until I actually create a hatch in the in the floor, which I plan to do, so that I can actually get to it without having to uh, drop the tank. Oh yeah. That's going to be quite some time off. Right. Uh, before I can do that. So yeah, uh, so his truck and the Dixie are the. Uh, on the same frame, they're both on the the uh, the 351-ton chassis. The only difference is one is a uh, F-series truck, the other is a, the E-series van.